going to the post office. All the blog sale packages are getting shipped out. We just finished up in Wailea, and so we were filming for what is going to be our new Etsy store. So we're shooting photos of our jewelry down at the shops at Wailea, and while we were there, I decided to stop in the Enchantress Boutique. So let me show you what I got here. So first off, I had to get some new Bootsy Oil. Now, I still have my other rollerball, but I wanted to get another rollerball for in my purse and then keep the other one at home. So now I have two of those. And then, since Halloween is coming up, I had to get a new set of bunny ears, and I couldn't resist these. Look how cute these are. How adorable are those? And I love, it's the pink sequins, so it's extra flashy. It has the marabou feathers, really cute. So I will do like a tutorial, not like another, well, let's see, not like another tutorial like I did before with the bunny rabbit, but um, I'll just do like my actual makeup that I am wearing Halloween night. Let me see what else I have here. Okay, and I also got these glitters. And Bootsy actually makes these, so let me show you these. They are so beautiful. Is, so I don't know if this is going to come up on camera. Oh, that glitter is so pretty. So this one is like, well, it's like a white, but it has like kind of blue flashes in it. Really pretty reflex. And then the other one I got is the gold. Where did the sun go? Oh, look at that. I love gold glitter, so that one's going to be really pretty. So I can't, and those are, um, uh, I can use those on my eyes too. It's a cosmetic grade glitter. Okay, and now we are at long, so let's go see what I can find in there. Here's red cherry lashes. I'm actually looking for my Miss Adora lashes, which usually they were carrying them right next to the red cherries, but now I can't find them anywhere. I don't know where they moved them or if they just stopped carrying them. Let's see, I don't really need any makeup, that's for sure. But it's still fun to look, see if there's anything new. And, oh, this is really cute. This is all Sanrio oh, clearance. Sanrio jewelry. Cute stuff. Ooh, blingy cell phone cases. I need a bling cell phone case, but not that one. We're headed back to Kahului, leaving Kihei. We're going to the Cow Cow Market. I don't know why I always call it the Cow Cow Kitchen. I call it Cow Cow Kitchen. Oh. Anyway, so this is a food court and it has one of our favorite Mexican little eateries here. We're at Fernando's at Cow Cow Market. Having chimichanga, ooh, salsa, guacamole, sour cream for Michael, taupe. So I'm in Walmart looking at hard candy and I have to get this blush here. This is Living Doll and I already had this but I actually sent it to my friend and I miss it so I have to get another one. Anyways, um, also I want to know if you guys have seen these new hard candy mascaras. This Lashaholic in particular. This packaging is like so cute and I really want to get it but I just looked up reviews on Makeup Alley which I spend, a, I spend a lot of time in the makeup aisles looking at reviews on my phone. But this just looks so adorable. I want to know if any of you guys have used this and like it, let me know. But the reviews on Makeup Alley, it was like 14%. Like, people didn't like it. So I was kind of bummed, so I'm afraid to get it. So I'm going to wait on that. Okay, now I'm at the Revlon section here, and I'm trying to find some lipsticks, some frost lipsticks because I'm tired of just wearing like MAC gel or my CoverGirl Lip Perfection, which I love those, but I kind of need to, you know, 
have something new once in a while that's in a frost. So I'm seeing, oh, I kind of like some of these up here, maybe like porcelain pink, that would be cute, or champagne on ice. But I don't know, do these have a scent? Because I don't want them to be scented. So I'm trying to find one that's open. I know, that's bad, but I promise I won't open one. I don't do that. But in case someone else did. Oh look, this one I think is open. Okay, let me see this. Okay, I'm also looking for like some super wild, like really dramatic lashes for Halloween. And I haven't found the right ones yet, but we are looking. I really like her lip color. That kind of looks like my, I think my CoverGirl Lip Perfection Verve lipstick. But this is a L'Oreal ad. Okay, you guys want to see a super awesome face wash that I got? This Neutrogena Deep Clean. It's new. I don't know how new it is, but the packaging sold me on it. It's so pretty. But it's a cleanser and a mask, and I've used it as both, and I've been meaning to do a review on it. But I figured since I was passing by here, I'd just show you guys this one. That actually does work. Like, the shine control part, yep. That works on me pretty well for most of the day, like at least, I don't know, six hours. I still haven't tried any of the Yes to Carrots products, but if you guys have any recommendations, or if you don't like it, let me know below because I'd like to know if this stuff is good or not. And here's one of my favorite toners. This is Neutrogena Rapid Clear 2-in-1 Fight and Fade. I use this all the time and I swear it really does work. It really does help like with any breakouts and it helps fade marks, so I love that. I love all the glassware at Walmart. So like if you live in a small town and all you have is a Walmart to shop at, like I don't have Target or any of those stores. I don't have Hobby Lobby. Oh my gosh, I would love to have a Hobby Lobby. That would be great. But uh, we do not. So I shop at Walmart a lot. And so like if you wanted to get like a nice glass, you know, glass jar for say your makeup brushes, like look at that. Look how cute that is. I like these lamps. These are cute. Like little purses. Very cute. There's our C's bag. Looking at this thing always makes me want chocolate now. Look at that. Oh my god, look at that one. Now we're going to Long's. So I'm going to see if I can find some big dramatic lashes. So when I first come into Long's, I like to stop right at the front counter here. And this is where they put like all of the new products that come out. So we got some Revlon stuff. What is this? That's kind of pretty. Starry pink. Doesn't want to show up. Let me see what's on the sale. Ah, oh, Physician's Formula. 40% off. I love it. Happy Booster products. I love those. Okay, so I'm at the dramatic kind of Halloween lash section here, and I'm really liking these. Ooh, with the hot pink and the black tips. Oh, I wonder what those would look like. That might be cute. And then there's like these with glitter tips. Oh, and it comes with a glitter liner. Ooh, I like that. Oh, that might be something. And then top and bottom lash sets. The feather ones are neat, but I don't like the blue if they had pink. I don't like green. Oh, those are neat. Wow, those would be fun. Ooh, and here's glitter top and bottom. Ooh, I love those. I want them all. I really like these, too. Oh, and there's only you know, there's two more pair. Wow, look at those. Those are super ultra dramatic. But they look like really soft and fluffy still, like fluttery, so I like that. Hmm, I might have to get those. Oh, but it comes with that green liner. Yuck, I don't like that. I might have to get them anyway and just, I don't know, give the liner away or something. I don't like those. 
so much. Now, ooh, wow. Pixie dust. Oh, yeah, we saw those on the other side. Crazy. Oh, those are so pretty. Dark angel. What is that one? Wicked. Those are cool. Okay, let's check the other section. Ooh, ooh, look at these. Wow, those are massive. Those are a little too much though. Those might be too heavy. Let's see. I like the ones with the glitter on them. They're cute. Not seeing any red cherries that I like. So, so far these are my picks here. I like that one, mesmerizing. But I hate the green liner. Jeez, I wish they sold it by itself. And then, goth princess. Those are kind of cute. I like how it has like those long, kind of feathery things sticking out on the sides. But I'm wondering how the pink would look close to the eye. I don't know. It might look kind of weird. It looks so pretty out here at night with the fountain and the theater lights. We're going to go see if there's anything clean at the movies. So I left Long's to come up here to Maxi's Costumes that just pops up just before Halloween. And it's only like 6, it's not even 6.45 and they're closed. And they don't even put on the door or the windows like they're hours. How rude. Oh well, I guess I won't be shopping there ever. One of my favorite pastimes, coming to look at baby guinea pigs. Uh-oh, Michael's getting a call. Oh, it is cute. Oh, look at that rabbit. Oh, he's really working for it. Where's the other guinea pigs? There's one. Oh my gosh, oh, they got a bunch of them in. Oh, hi baby. You're cute. Oh, that one's kind of cute too. Hello. Oh my gosh, it wants out. I wish I could take you home with me. Yeah, you're cute. Okay, so I'm home and I am so burned out. The past two days I've been doing nothing but being glued to my computer doing blog sale stuff. So that's finally over. Everyone's packages have shipped. There's only a couple left that we're waiting for payment on and then those are shipped out probably tomorrow. So I figured, um, so I've already done my day in the life video uh, or filming and I figured I'd just end it with a face of the day. So today um, I just did like a really quick smoky eye using my Chanel eyeshadow in Safari. It's just like a taupey kind of color. And then to kind of darken up I used NARS Coconut Grove. Anyway, sorry the lighting sucks. Um, and then um, for lips today I am wearing MAC Snob, which pretty much everyone knows what that looks like. Super pretty. Pink, like Barbie pink. And then over that, I'm wearing the Revlon lipstick that you just saw me get. This was porcelain pink. And so it's just like a, a frosty color. I'm, I'll show these products, or you know, I'll show like my haul in a haul video. Because I know the sliding, you're not going to be able to see the color really well. But it just gives like a little bit extra like frostiness. And then for nails, you're probably not going to be able to see it very well either. But it's like another gold sparkle or gold glitter combination. Um, so different than the one I've been wearing, uh, this one is, let's see, Zoya Rochelle. And so I do one coat of Zoya Rochelle, and then on top I use China Glaze Cleopatra. And I love this combination. You guys will see it, like, probably tomorrow I'll do, I, I'm going to do a beauty video tomorrow, I think, I hope. 
because um, yeah, I didn't mean to do like two day in the life videos in a row. It just kind of happened that way because I didn't have like any time to film. Um, okay, so nails, lips, eyes, um, and for like my haul stuff, I will. I know you guys already saw pretty much everything I got, but I'll just do a separate haul video because not everyone likes to watch the day in the day in the life videos. Some people just want to see the haul, um, so I'll do that too. Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow.